Line looks good. Light on set. Gates open away. Fisher stood there, missed it clearly. Rojo Boom was slow to muster there. Straight out the back. Belsawano begins well with Zoo to Z in the early part. Malibu Edition, Supremo, Boogie Knights are all handy. Equal Balance is just easing out of that speed battle. Rubble gets back on the inside. Saddler's song beside it, settling down from Miss Epinay. And after Tardy starts, Rojo Boom, Fisher the last two. So working down the back towards the 800 metre mark and the ghostly grey, Zuda Z. He's gone up onto the inside for Stan Sakos here to show the way just over Belsawano, who sits second the outside. Supremo gets a nice run third. And on its outside, Malibu Edition's right behind the pace. A Gap then to three lengths to equal balance, ridden along from Boogie Knights. Miss Epinay improving. Saddle a song behind those from Rubble. Well back Fisher, Rojo Boom. So approaching the four. And isn't it a sight, folks? Zoo to Z out in front. Coming around the turn at the three. And Sakos goes for home. And he put a length on Belsawano, who looks under pressure, but comes back. Over on the inside, Supremo. Malibu edition, equal balance, try to run on. A gap, Boogie Knights, Saddle a song, Miss Epinay. It's Zoo to Z at the 150, the leader. Belsawano trying ever so hard, but Zoo to Z... It's been a great display in front by Sakos and Zuda Z. That's two for Tayan Holder. And Zuda Z wins it a length on the line to Bel Sawano. Third equal balance and then Malibu edition. A gap in the field to Supremo. Boogie Knights, Miss Epinay, Fisher. Saddler's song, Rubble well back in the field. And Rojo Boom, the last one home. Well, Zuda Z. It looks like the Lone Ranger coming down the straight. And he is dead set. Gone on to score in great style over Bel Sawano who just couldn't get there. Tried ever so hard, an equal balance, eased back out of the speed, came on strong late, will go down by about two lengths in the end. But Zuda Z, he can certainly bring it on his day. He won on Cup Day here a couple of years ago at big odds. And this afternoon, he's gone around at decent odds too. Tayan Holder has won the last two, and that's one for Stan Sakos on the board this afternoon. Number eight, Zuda Z in 115.13. Found the lead, which is probably not normally his go, but he was able to get there today. He was right on his game. And he has raced away. Second goes to seven, Bel Sawano, who tried hard. Just got shaken before the turn, but then made another effort in the straight just to go down by a length. And third will go to two equal balance, the favourite doing a fair job from a wide gate. A length by a length. 1.15.13 the time, 8.72. And we stand by for fourth. That'll go to six, Malibu edition. Eight, Zuda Z. It's a 10-year-old grey gelding, top echelon, Jawara... Elsie for C.E.R. Searle, trained by Tayan Holder and Stan Sakos in the winning circle this afternoon. Stan, the man, good to have him here in the top end. Second goes to seven, Bel Suano, a five-year-old bay man, a coney, beautiful sound for Gary Clark and Jared Todd. And third to two, equal balance, an eight-year-old bay gilding, Hinchinbrook equivalents for Kim Healy, Mark Pegas. So fourth to six, Malibu Edition, uh, received a nice running transit. And fifth went to one, Supremo, another horse who was uh, pretty much in a fair spot throughout. But take nothing away from Zuda Z. He's, uh, he's a, certainly an eye catcher. He had a bit of a campaign over there in the West where he had success. And to be fair, folks, he's been pretty fair here. He never really runs a bad race. He certainly doesn't win out of turn, but that uh, he does win over Carnival. That's one thing he does. And uh, he's a beauty this afternoon. He's about to return, folks. That's win eight now from 78 starts. And that win this afternoon will take his prize money up over the $165,000 mark. Put your hands together, folks. Winner returning, number eight, Zuda Z, Stan Sakos, Tayan Holder. We wait for correct weight.